is getting an award. He's I think back. he's over Major in. Award. Is he in Amsterdam? Yes, he's Amnesty. He's getting one of Pete's favorite awards. Of course, the Amnesty International <laughs> Award, which I'm every year in the running I don't know for. How you didn't win. Every year. <laughs> well, yesterday he gave a speech there in the Netherlands, uh, and this is what Colin Kaepernick had to say about his anthem protest. Listen. How can you stand for the national anthem of a nation that preaches and propagates freedom and justice for all? That is so unjust to so many of the people living there. How can you not be in a rage when you know that you are always at risk of death in the streets or enslavement in the prison system? How can you willingly be blind to the truth of systemic racialized injustice? My love for my people serves as the fuel that motivates me and fortifies me on my mission. It is the people's unbroken love for themselves that motivates me even when faced with dehumanizing norms of a system that can lead to the loss of one's life over simply being black. Now, only a portion of his speech was played online. The rest we have from the written remarks. And he went on to say this in the speech as well, as if that wasn't bad enough. He said, racialized oppression and dehumanization is woven into the very fabric of our nation, the effects of which can be seen in the lawful lynching of black and brown people by the police and the mass incarceration of black and brown lives in the prison industrial complex. You know, so we had Frank Siller on the show, yeah. um, and 